Hello people, this is Player L here, and welcome to my theory about the Pokemon Scarlet and Violet Professors. So, if you guys didn't know or didn't pick up on it in the new trailers for Scarlet and Violet, the Professors are stated to have already passed on in the story of the games. But that seems a little odd if they're supposed to be the Professors of the region and we won't be doing research for them. Maybe we'll just be doing research, like field research for the academy we enroll in, but I feel that if the Professors are a part of the story and they're showing them off saying, hey, these characters are important, remember them. Sounds to me, they will be more involved with the story than just being background characters you look at for guidance through videos and research. So, since both Professor Sada and Toro's names literally kind of represent past and future, makes me think that they would be doing some kind of research into the past and future, and maybe like some time travel stuff, we might say. And as for how they got to the past and future, take a look at the world map, and what do you see out of the ordinary? Right in the middle of the map, in the middle of the whole region, is a massive crater with a weird vortex inside of it. And off to the side, we see some kind of facility that dips down off the edge of the cliff, but not all the way. So my theory is that this is, has to be some kind of temporal phenomenon happening in the professors went to investigate, and end up getting sucked in and travel to a different time period. And now they'll need help from beings that can travel back and forth through time. And they may have known about you, the player, entering the academy, and decided to seek out the legendaries of the region so you and the legendaries can find a way to bring them back and stop, you know, whatever possible calamity from happening. Because, you know, every Pokemon game has some kind of calamity gonna happen. And that's why you get the legendaries early, because they were sent or are aware of the Professor situation. So they decided to just go back to the past and get you early on and find you and stick around with you instead of just waiting for you to come to them. But anyways, that's my theory on why the professors are considered dead in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. So if you liked my theory, leave a like on the video, comment if you guys want to talk about this idea more, and sub and hit the bell if you want to see more of my content. Anyways, I'll catch you all later.